there's no magic bullet. Um, we do look at traditional financial data, we do look at market data, spanning thousands of coins at every major exchange, but all of this data needs to be mixed and correlated with other important data streams. Uh, this includes technical data, so we look at GitHub repositories, um, we look at blockchain data, we look at data from mining pools, we also look at natural language data. Um, this includes traditional media, social media, um, messenger channels, and um, decisions of financial regulators around the world. Um, I can give you two specific examples. So one is looking at developer statistics. Most cryptocurrency projects are open and you can look at things like um, what the developer community around a specific cryptocurrency project is doing. You can look at the number of commits, you can look at subscribers, um, the num number of open issues and closed issues and the rate of change of these things over time. And all of that um, is a very good measurement to uh, look at the health of a cryptocurrency project. Another example is mining. Investors should want to know whether the optimal way to obtain a coin is to purchase it on the open market or buy a mining pool contract to obtain that coin. And sometimes there are big price differences. Um, but in order to do that, you need to have access to exchange data, um, hashing power information, data from mining pools and other sources.